where in the hell are you going? Where are you going? Oh, I... <laughs> we are back at the Missouri State Pen. My buddy Noodles. Hi. We've got our special guests again. Hi. Hi. We're about to get Actually, locked in. Yeah. Locked in. It's like a deep bassy thump, thump, thump. thump. The study showed that this pink was extremely calming. That was me. Okay. Was ex that was that wasn't. Turn your spotlight up. Ooh. That was a step above us. Totally. Did we hear you walking around? Was that you? She was here talking. Yeah. That is talking. If I knock, can you knock back? <gasps> now we see what we can see. See what we can hear. <gasps> that was oh. like. That was the whole roof just shut. Yeah. We've got a REM pod on crack over here. Are they coming back here because this is all they know? For a lot of Do you understand? If you even want to communicate. That's very clear. Okay. Uh, around the corner from that is the one of the solitary confinement cells. I'm going to go lock myself in. Are you the one who keeps hitting the stop button on my night vision? You can hold it. Is this what you felt? Is this what it felt like to be locked in here? Jefferson City, once home of the Osage people, or the Wazaz, present-day Jefferson City is now home of the Missouri State Capitol, as well as more than 43,000 souls, some living, some not. Many believe this building, the Missouri State Penitentiary, to be the home of many of those not living souls. And as the years go by, paranormal investigators have amassed evidence to support this theory. Join us as we delve into the bloodiest 47 acres in Missouri, the Missouri State Penitentiary. So, I just got done with a solo in the uh, solitary confinement cell up in the women's block. And uh, I'm not sure exactly what to make of it. Uh, just in, I'm recording this just in case the uh, um, night vision didn't actually get anything, but something hit the stop button on the night vision four or five times, well, five times now, and uh, basically it just didn't want me to record in there. Then I started, like, getting anxiety or something. Felt like uh, I couldn't breathe, felt like the, the walls were closing in. I had to get the hell out. Now we're outside, everyone was starting to feel sick. They were sitting outside the room waiting for me and uh, just started getting nauseous and everything. Even my heart is still racing. <sighs> so now we're heading into uh, housing unit four, uh, home of the dungeon. Home of most of the uh, activity that goes on here. And also home to the lights that like to turn on and off by themselves. Walking in here a moment ago, we actually had uh, something far down at the uh, far end of the uh, building walking back and forth in front of the box. I'll, I'll show you shortly, but there's like a large box over there and a movie projector, very old movie projector. And um, yeah, I, I saw it first and then uh, Nikki and Noodles saw it again. We'll see what we can see. Maybe it's my imagination, but I thought I saw a flash of light up there on the third level. I can't swear to it though. I can swear at it, but I can't swear to it.
while you were talking, I heard a clanking sound. It sounded like somebody did like a fall on a metal floor. And it was somewhere over here or up here. Uh, give it a shot. R remind me to turn it back on. I've had my cameras uh, stopped so many times tonight, it's ridiculous. This one twice, the night vision five times. It's getting to be irritating. I'm here to record, not talk to myself. 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 Robbery, murder, uh, opium. Yeah. Missouri did have a major opium trade back in the day. Yeah, she was saying there was also a lot of like, marijuana in the 1800s. It's possible. Uh, I guarantee you the plant has been around longer than people have been smoking it. <laughs> Ooh, it's tripping. Okay. If there is someone here, you can get a little closer. Can you come closer and talk to us? Yeah, it's tripping. I just want to know just why you're in here. Why you're still here. I think I heard someone ask who we are. Um, I'm Tori. And this is Nikki. I'm Literally thing. Not <laughs> Oh, uh, just, yeah, just by the by, I'm Tommy. Who are you? Cold, Yeah, but we may have a breeze coming from that door. I just don't know if we'd be able to feel it for this far in. I mean, there's a light down in the shower room that's still on, okay, that as well as one fan. Now there is cell nine. The light in cell nine sometimes kicks on, mm -hmm. as well as one up there that happened when Jack Osborne was here. It just turns on. Yeah. Can and someone turn the light on? I'm a little bit scared of the dark. That'd be really nice. So last time I was here, the uh, upper levels were still considered um, unsafe slash condemned. But apparently they've got everything uh, taken care of now. So I'm gonna hop upstairs and see what's what. Damn, these are some short steps. I left noodles with the Got Ghost crew.
I just heard a footstep right behind me. I just heard a footstep right behind me. I just heard a footstep right behind me. Right f***ing behind me. Who is that? Standing here with my back to an open cell door. Alright, not anymore though. Try this again. I just want to know who you are. And why are you still here? We're here to learn your story, if you are willing to tell us. I'm also here to film the chest of my t-shirt. <laughs> Evidently. Alright, now I'm up where the lights in a certain cell kicked on. When Ozzy Osbourne's boy, uh, I think his name is Jack, right? They were here doing an investigation, and flip this viewfinder around. They were here doing an investigation. Um, this was right after the new roof was put on, and so all these upper-level uh, catwalks were still considered um, unsafe. So nobody could get up here to turn it on, and definitely nobody was allowed to get up here to turn it off. A windowless cell, that's weird. This is different. Okay, the window's over here. All right. Imagine that being your only look at the outside world until it was time to go out to the yard. guys. Because it turns out the camera can still use the light to see me, even if it's not shining directly in my face. Which it can be very advantageous to be able to see in front of me, you know? peek a -boo. I wonder, do I dare go to the third level or the fourth level? I have my meter with me. That's really all I need is a camera, a meter, and a flashlight. It did? He's making me nervous. Okay, part of that floor flexed and I did not like that. <laughs> it was okay until I got to this area right here, then the floor started flexing and I'm just like, okay, I'm gonna step a little bit faster. <laughs> Yeah, we've got four levels of this. How do you know? Right over there in those uh, far corners, there's a stairwell on either side. Yep. 
<laughs> I said it. Okay, this one is closed, and wow, look at that dilapidated ceiling. And look, even more dilapidated ceiling. I have kind of a sick thought for you. Remember how they said that for a long time this was the uh, black only population? Yeah. You remember me telling you about how over in uh, building three uh, they had to put fencing up in front of these to A, prevent people from jumping off and killing themselves, and B, to prevent others from throwing uh, their enemies off to kill them. They did not give a damn about whether or not the uh, black population did that to each other. That's f***ed up. What the hell? Oh. Uh, what? I, I heard walking over here. It's Tori. I didn't realize she already got past me already. It's a spirit. <laughs> An alleged spirit. <laughs> How does Lone Star Paranormal say it? Spirit. It's my cousin. He he does some fun accents. Oh, yeah. Oh. Hey. What? Sorry, it just occurred to me. This, this is like that uh, area in Deep Space Nine where they're always sitting uh, with their uh, legs dangling off the catwalk. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. You do have to. You're gonna get pulled off. There we go. It's not gonna be a fun video if you get pulled. Yeah, well, at least the camera will get snagged up and stay behind. This would be the worst place to get, like, dragged by spirits. <laughs> yeah, it would be. I'm having fun. Oh, my God. All right. <laughs> um, okay, so you were telling us uh -huh. or telling them about, like, a hallway that had never been explored? Yeah, um, when we went on the tour with Miss Jenny, she was pointing out a, uh, a door up near the uh, solitary confinement cells in the women's block mm -hmm. that um, they haven't had open since the place was decommissioned. Because mm -hmm. again, there's only four keys to over a thousand doors. And, uh, and she said you can't pick the lock. I didn't ask, because they, they don't know where the, that door is. They don't know where it is? Yeah, they, they don't know what door she's referring to. Okay. So Jenny knows, but she's not here. I, th I think she's the one that's on vacation right now. And then there's the the door that's like bricked up. Yep, that is down in the dungeon here. I saw okay. that in a video from Amy's Crypt. I didn't even notice that when I was here. And I, I think I went all the way around, but I'm not sure. But again, somebody has been chiseling at the cinder blocks, and so there's a hole all the way through the uh, wall mm -hmm. into the cell, and I'm hoping to send an endoscope through there and see what we find. That'll be awesome. Yeah. yeah, maybe a little creepy too. I don't know, I feel like said. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, like the endoscope into that, I feel like we're gonna see dead bodies or something. Yeah. yeah. yeah that's that, what that's giving. That kind of worries me too. Because people tried to escape from here and did not succeed. Or if they did succeed, they were just like I would, brought back pretty much. I would feeling. feel more comfortable doing an endoscope if like one of the workers was here too. Just in case we found them. Oh, Let's just do it. We're just gonna do it. Let's if we spot something, we'd, we'd definitely give well, them a holler. Well, obviously, yeah, yeah, we have to tell them. Yeah. We're not gonna be like, <laughs> we're not gonna be like, eh, let's not tell anyone. Oh, YouTube's gonna know, the internet's gonna know, but the people who work here won't. Yeah. <laughs> hey, we found a carcass. So, I'm going to open up the line of communication with the dowsing rods. Would you be able to talk with us? Yeah. I feel like we could use that app that we were using yesterday. Yeah, mm -hmm. in there. Oh, necrometer? Yeah. It's worth a shot. Do you have that with you? Because we don't have that. Yeah, I got my okay. phone, so yeah. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Sweaty ass print. <laughs> I do not like that spot. <laughs> okay, 
Okay, guys. Ooh, I don't like that one either. Oof. Guys, because of these doors, we're shut on us. All right, I'm gonna set that right here. I guess maybe we have her. List. All right. All right. We can lean it against the wall. Oh, good idea. Yeah. All right. There we go. It shouldn't take too much lead with you. The spirit that we were talking to, can you tell us your name? You told us that there was a list are you referring to the list that was discovered recently by one of the workers here? The list of people who were tortured? Were you on that list, unfortunately? Do you wish that we could read the list? I know it might be intimidating to have all of these Gravel. Gravel. What's gravel? There, there is a lot of gravel here. Is there something we need? Oh my god. I wonder if that's mousy, mousy or snake. No, no, that's giving trying to get Escape. out uh, or hide something. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hey, you have that endoscope? Should we put it in there? That's what she said. <laughs> <laughs> Watch yourself. We see that there is a little hole in the room near some gravel. Were you digging? What's in there? What are we going to find if we look in there? Is there a different list? Is there another list that needs to be discovered? Oh, if we find a piece of paper in there. Oh my god. Fixated. Fixated. Were you fixated on this, creating this little hideaway spot for yourself? If this was even yourself. Ooh. Or are we fixing on the wrong thing? Fixing it on the wrong thing. Can you tell us more about gravel? What you mean by that? If I'm death, death, death bed. Did you die in the cell? Or did you make a list on your death bed? And he's got the tools. Okay. It's a deathbed. So they we got the tools. We have talent. It's a deathbed. So we said we were fixated on something. But it could have been them fixated. Right. Twelve. Twelve. Twelve names on the list. Twelve things you want to do? Was this people that you didn't like that you wanted to hurt? Maybe? Information. Information. Twelve, infer twelve pieces, pieces of information. That shows. Where is the list? We find the list. I'm so freaked out. I hope we find something in there. I hope it's not a snake. All right, and there it is. I've only messed with this a couple of times, so. Really? Mood. What is your mood? Okay, where is the... Come on. So what are we looking at? 
There it is, good. Okay. Uh, we're looking at a big hole. That's so, nothing on that side. What's that? What's the blue thing? Come on. Oh, that's just a chip. Oh, okay. Okay, because it's really small. This is not focused. Well, wait, wait, wait. The hole is big. It's kind of deep. But not too far. No. Did you mean to leave something in there? Or are we fixated on the wrong spot? They did say fixated. Yeah. You can you can tell us we want to know the information. Sure. Yeah. Okay. So we're sure they can tell us, or sure and we're fixated on the wrong spot, or both. We we want to know. We want to know what you have to tell us. We want to know the information. Because we know there are secrets here. Wait and see. Oh. Oh, oh okay. Wait and see what? What do you want us to wait and see? Well, where can we go to find the list? You know what, gravel? This isn't actually gravel, right? Right, this is all painted. Right, right. Okay. so where would gravel be? In the courtyard. Right? Yeah. Like if they hit something. Yeah, was there gravel in the courtyard? I forgot. Uh, the oh. courtyard is a lot of um, grass. grass. There's maybe gravel underneath it. Mm -hmm. Can you tell us where to find this list or how to find the information? Not likely. Not likely. Oh. They're not going to tell us. Okay. We're going to have to work for it. You work. Can you tell us what, what we're going to see? If we put the endoscope in the bricked up door? I should have grabbed my other phone. I get really good results using a necrophonic alongside necrometer or a spirit talker. Mm -hmm. Do you want one? I have necrophonics. Oh, I don't have my phone. Oh. We can do it downstairs. All right. Yeah. <laughs> we put another communication dates. Creeps. What the heck does that mean? Is that a name? That is probably specific. Yeah. Does anyone know what that means? No. Someone have a phone? Oh, I did. I have one. I've had one. Yeah. I have one. Look it up. I will go. Ooh, we're getting I spikes. Go. I will okay. go. Where will you go? Can we follow you? I want to ask him who Creeps is. Yeah, real quick. Graves is a bird. What? It is? A diving bird. bird. It's the birds. It said bird. Those were pages though, weren't they? Yeah. yeah. They were talking. It couldn't be this bird. This is like a duck. Mm -hmm. But they mentioned bird earlier yeah. when you were in like, solitary. Like, it, is it like a duck? Oh. Like, like sitting ducks? I think that's a stretch. Yeah. It has that stretch. Because they could have said duck. <laughs> Um, and it's it's like technically a diving bird. Predictable. Predictable. <laughs> What's predictable? Us. So I don't want to go through any of that old 1960s Batman TV series kind of logic, but Greaves. Is there any way Greaves, the diving bird, could be connected to a stool pigeon in any way? What is a stool pigeon? A snitch. Oh. I can't find anything about it. You actually say that again because it's not recording. Okay. Um, the possibility that Greaves might actually be related to uh, a stool pigeon. Like the, a Greaves is a diving bird. What uh, family is it? 
what yeah. breed. I guess her. that's why like I was kind of going with the sitting duck cycle because it's like when what was the lingo yeah. back then? What were they saying? What were the little like quips that they were saying in this prison? Yeah. Almost because they probably would talk a little bit in code or some sort oh, yeah. of slang vernacular mm -hmm. so that the guards wouldn't know right. what right. they were talking about. Oh uh, yeah, that's common. So I know a couple of people like to ask about this after the fact, but it won't help us right now. Yeah. I'm wondering if like it's a name too. That's a possibility. But like especially with immigrants coming straight from specific places. Yeah, Missouri was a major stopping off point for German yeah. immigrants. Yeah, I can't find anything about it. Breed sounds like a German name. Kind of, yeah. It seems like they will wait and see. That's the second time. I don't really like that. Mm -hmm. What are we waiting for? <laughs> I think we should go down and see with my that door. So yeah. I'm itching to see if it Maybe that's there. what they're talking about. Yeah. Why don't you just go see? Just go see? Yeah, maybe. Okay. We or I will go wait and oh, see. So wait and see. I will go to wait and see. Like with us? Maybe. I don't know. We are going to go <laughs> down to the dungeon. The dungeon. Um, no, that. Yeah. So, forget this. You can come with us if you want. Mine looks like it keeps wanting to say something, and it just doesn't go. So, what you got going on here? Okay, so state versus Grebe, Boone County. State of Missouri, oh, respondent of versus Ruth Grebe at oh, Appalent. This was all men, right? How about like that? I don't know. We'll have to look into that. We'll wait. Jeff City. Appellant I Grebe was convicted what? of manslaughter under uh, state whatever yeah, the I hell. Yeah, I saw that, but I couldn't, I couldn't see if he went, he came here. Ah, uh, oh, it says, because I tried to search, uh, find penitentiary and it didn't come up. Jeff City for respondent. So something came through Jeff City. I'm sure the court was out here and most likely for something like that. Or even if they knew him, you know? Just, yeah. This is probably the closest prison to Boone County, wouldn't you think? I think so. Not unless the uh, one on Ch Church Farm Road was in operation. We are now headed to the dungeon. I have a feeling there's going to be some uh, dude named Estes involved. <laughs> and also we are going to see if we can scope that uh, prison cell that's been bricked over and someone has apparently been chiseling or hammering their way through the cinder blocks that are blocking that prison cell. So there's a hole through the wall straight through into the cell. You can see the cell doors behind that hole. And uh, yeah, we got the sneaking suspicion that there might be a secret to be told in there. That switch is a little jittery, I'll admit it. Yeah, from what I understand, it's supposed yeah, to be this one right here. Wait, come here. Don't you remember yesterday it said Firebug? At the mansion? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, well, J.D. Firebug was the one who went blind in this dungeon's house. What are the odds of that? That is kind of weird. And this is the same session where it kept uh, bringing up names of my family members. Yeah. Yep. I don't think it's necessary. You can't hear anything in here. Especially after you close that door. Okay, so we got chairs. Yeah. Hey, guess what? what? Do you remember when Necrometer said gravel? Yeah. Take a look at this. Where are you? Oh. I mean, granted, it's the wall falling apart, but. But it's gravel. Yeah. Totally. What the hell? What? Is this, uh, no, is it? What? 
No, I, I was thinking along the lines of something from a morgue, but that would have a raised lip around the edge of it. Yeah. Anyways. Yeah, really. So is this where the door is? Nope. Uh, go out here and turn left. Oh, and also, do these lights not turn off? It's this. I don't think we need them. This? Yep. I mean, maybe we need to do something out there. Yeah, but right now we're doing it. Here we go, we boys. Can you not see through that with your camera? Oh, great. Oh, there's something else? Yeah, there's a wall. They put a wall? Yeah, it's a steel plate. What about down here? That is just the middle of the cinder block. What about over there in that corner? I have no idea what that is. And that only goes maybe and this is half an inch back. This is closed? Yeah. yeah. Another we can't send the endoscope like around something? I don't know. We, we'll give it a shot. Okay, I think this steel plate only goes to right there. There's like a hole. See right, if you look to the right. Oh yeah, we can get the scope around I think we that. Go around it. Holy feces, Batman. Yeah, yeah. Unless there's another one. Risky business. Uh dude. No, it's not dead. Uh, oh. <laughs> All of our hearts are kissing, kissing me off. <laughs> Okay, who's ready for the colonoscopy? Yeah. Is it going in? It's going in. Without lube. <laughs> Perfect. Now we're on. Oh, where are we in? What? Or we're stuck. I Gotta think it's go just, in and bend. It's just my hands. You got big, big hands. Oh, All right, small right. hand Tori. She can do it. Yeah. She has little baby Asian hands. I do. I do too. Hearing sounds upstairs. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, that doesn't right. work. Stop recording. And let's try. Oh, that's not what I need. I don't even know if I want to be out here for this. It's too late now. <sighs> there we go. I'll already uh... rotate. I've got nothing. Nothing? Yeah. It's like wherever I'm at. Okay, here we go. No. Rotate. No, not the screen. Did you not look at this before you came down here? Yeah. <laughs> but when I try to switch cameras, it just locks up. Oh. Mm. Oh. That wait and see is just like ringing in my ear. I know. Okay, I have no idea what the hell's going on here, but we're being roadblocked, if you will. Okay, what if we go up? We could try. Above it? Well, I, what's in this hole? This is blocked. That's blocked by a uh, scale. Yeah. Why is it? Well, actually, that's, that's the middle of the cinder block. It, it's not even like a real cinder block. It's uh, one of those thin ones. And you're looking at the uh, inner surface of it. Oh, I'm getting shot in your ass. Sorry. No, it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's see. So. <laughs> Could you potentially go from the other side, like the in, the side of the cell? That's a good point. Is there anything in that cell? You guys check. So this is by the gravel. Hey, Dad. Yes. Yes. I'm trying to see if there's any mold in your area where you see sticks. It's about to die. Whoa, whoa. Wait, whoa. what? What? Whoa. What? Whoa, 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 whoa. What the hell did I just see that Wait. looked like the top of a skull? Wait. No way. 
No, it's that thing. Never mind. Oh. Shit. That screwed with me. What is that? That. Oh, are you in? <laughs> what is that? <laughs> yeah, are you in? <laughs> That's what she said. Sort of. <laughs> sort of. Just the tip. <laughs> Yeah, we are past. Now, I, I am literally in the room. Let's see what we've got going on here. Okay, that's the side camera. If I can carefully rotate that, that should give us a decent look around. Okay, so rotate the other so way. I'm getting really hot. I know. Yeah. I can't even see in the screen. Sorry. Sorry, it's not focusing. No, it's just, it's not focusing. What is that? I don't know. Another wall? Yeah. There's a gap in there too. No. I can't get to it because basically this thing is sweeping past the gap. I don't have a way to articulate that other than to pull the whole camera out and bend the wire by hand. Now this endoscope, does it report? Like, are you recording this? It's recording right now. Mm -hmm. Okay. So What's that? Yeah. That is probably grout down at the bottom of the wall. Mm -hmm. See how over here it bunches up every time it uh, reaches the bottom mm -hmm. of the brick? But why would that grout be at a gap like that? That just looks weird. What? What is that? What is that? Mm-hmm. I was going in. <laughs> oh, not really. Oh, like, like I said, this gap is beside the camera. I'm using the side camera uh, to see it. What is that? I don't know. Is this what it looks like when they go in your butt? <laughs> no, that's usually pinker. I know, I saw, I saw the pictures from mine. <laughs> Yep. Most of the time. Until they had to eat. I think there's oh. someone walking outside. So why don't we see some shadows, but we need the lights on. Before we do that, or before I get involved with that, I've got to go swap batteries again. Okay. That's up in the main building on the charger, so. Okay. It's a minute. Okay. You guys do what you need to do and I'll be right back. No, I won't sneak up and try to scare anyone this time. But eventually I won't. That was interesting. I was hoping to see some sort of something. Maybe a answer to what the secrets are around here, but unfortunately my endoscope does not articulate. And the ones that do cost about four or five hundred more dollars than this one here that I have. So it is what it is. So I'll go do a battery swap. Oh, it's nice out here. It's like 55 degrees or so. Oh, it's like 80 down in the dungeon. Oh, lordy. I don't even know what time it is. It's gotta be after midnight by now. Let me see. Check the phone. Yeah, it's after midnight, it's going on two. Huh? There. I didn't know it was still running. 
So as soon as I unlocked it, it said I was there. Okay. Okay, that was weird. That's me. Yep. Yeah. Well, not all the way, all the way. But like it's right up against the edge of the door frame. Yeah. Here's where I found those bats last time I was here. Yeah. I'm just like, nope. Chairs in this hallway? Yep. This would be a great time for my night vision. <laughs> yeah. It's upstairs. Or I can let the cap off laugh. Ooh. Ooh. I don't know if I can decipher anything. Can you guys? If you guys can, that's fine. I don't have very good eyes. How about that? Oh, oh yeah, okay. I can set this way over here. Now I can see if there's like a shadow. Okay, I just heard a woman. What'd you hear? So you saw when I raised my hand like this, mm -hmm. I had something right over here. It felt like that thumping sound that you get when somebody waves their hand past your ear real quick. Mm -hmm. I didn't get any of the wind, it was just like the thump itself. And going over some of the footage from when I was here last time, I had this discussion with somebody else too, and they had the same thing happen. Uh, you would actually feel what felt like somebody doing this yeah. by your ear, but you didn't hear it. All you felt was the air pressure of it passing by your ear. Wait, is that what it felt like? Yeah, but this is more like a fluttering. Someone at, was that someone here? Or was that something? When? Right after he was like, I heard something over there. There was like a mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah, I heard definitely talking. Okay. Yeah, I knew it was here. I heard something. It sounded like a woman. I don't know. I thought it was just. I think it's time for me to end the death row. 
I think so too. Let's do it and see what we can see. <laughs> No, just kidding. I had to do it sooner or later. <laughs> so, um, we're over in housing unit three now where I had my very bizarre experience last year. Turn this light down. There we go. So yeah, um, I'm gonna take Noodles over there and I wanna see what she thinks of the area. And yeah, well, we'll go from there. The hell? What? Okay, there's open windows here, so I might have to disregard that. What? Ear. Some sort of sound like that. No? No, I was on the ground level here, because... Okay, let's head back down. I remember I was looking straight up at the ceiling fans when I sat down. is bumping my ass. My cell phone. Oh. Okay, it has to be the other end of the building. <sighs> That's got a whiff of sewage. I'm guessing this was the guard post. Yeah, that ceiling is not in very good condition. So it has to be this side of the building. I'm trying to find that spot where I had my experience. There it is. Oh, that's the rolly chair that I saw earlier. <laughs> that's funny. Yeah. It's right across from these, the shower and staff only. I feel sick already. Told you, they had better showers over here than they had in the women's quarters. And it's double shower, but yeah, still. Don't drop the soap. Yeah. All right. So, what I want to do is I want to have you sit down there and just get your opinion on what you're feeling. Yeah. It supported my fat ass. It'll support you. No, I'm not even concerned about it. Oh. And I'll flip the light down so it's not up in your face. 